James from Let's Paint Brush here, and we've got a bit of a first for you. We're doing a product review. Now, um, last week there was a post by a company called Model Railway Boards on Facebook saying that if you liked and shared this post, you'll be in a chance of winning a 6x4, um, well, I'm going to call it a gaming table, but um, a model baseboard for model railways. And so I liked and shared, and then a good friend of mine quite, um, commented on it saying we could do a review on my YouTube channel and the bloke who owns the company got back to me within minutes and we had a bit of a chat and here we are. So as I said the company is called Model Ra Railway Baseboards and he sent um, one of his diorama bases. He does loads of different sizes. Um, I've got um, a size list there prices now and then and also he does tables which is what he wants to sell to the wargaming community because he's got six by fours he's got eight by fives he's got even stuff that's 12 by four and they're all let's get on with the review now this one is a diorama base as i said earlier it is 400 by 700 which is a perfect size if you're going to be doing um, a canal scene or something like that for your model railway um it's probably a good thing to use for armies at parade as well just to work out where your miniatures are going to go before you do the final board. But as you can see, it's made of MDF. It is good quality MDF as well. It hasn't got that dodgy smell that some MDF there has. It is incredibly well constructed. As you can see, it's been glued. And I don't know if you can see that, it's been pinned as well. So the chances of these coming apart, you're going to have to do something spectacular to break these ones. Um, the edges have been sanded, the joins are really, really good. And I can only imagine what a full size table will look like. But yeah, this is going to be strong, it's going to be resilient. And yeah, I think this is going to be a really good product to have, even in something the size of 6x4 for a gaming table.